G'day, my name is Chris Betcher and I am going to show you how to make one of these lovely Celtic knots in Illustrator. So the first thing we're going to do is uh, go over to the uh, shape tool here, choose the ellipse tool, and first thing is to draw a circle. Now there's your thing, hold down the option key, which will draw from the center, and the shift key, which will make it a perfect circle. So we'll just draw a circle, say about that big, there you go. Uh, we probably just want to make inside of that just transparent for now. Okay, now the next thing we want to do is change to the rounded rectangle tool. Uh, we'll just uh, deselect that shape uh, just by clicking away from it. Okay, and uh, the rounded rectangle tool, go, let's go from the center. Again, hold down the option key, that just lets us draw from the center like that, and we'll draw that shape quite large. And then we need to rotate it around the center. So choose the rotate tool, which is this one. And I'm going to hold down the shift key, which will make it rotate in uh, 45 degree angles and introduce the option key. And that will duplicate that. So you can see there I have all the basic shapes now for this uh, Celtic knot. So the easiest way to turn this into a shape, these are outlines at the moment. You can see if I just outline that with um, the wireframing tool. Uh, that's just a series of lines. So what I'm going to do is in fact, from the properties panel, just increase the stroke weight of those lines. Make them quite thick, maybe something like so. That looks pretty good. Uh, and so now these are actually uh, lines with very thick strokes on them. But what I want to do is convert them to shapes. Easy enough to do, go to the object menu and choose expand and fill and stroke and there you go so those outlines uh, strokes have now been converted to actual shapes now we need to change a few things here so i'm just going to select all that again and change its fill color so let's make it say this green color here and let's give it a stroke so we'll choose that stroke color and we'll just bump that up uh, to something like uh, that looks pretty good just like that all right, so we have the right shapes. We need to now get the interlocking pattern you can see on the screen there. The easiest way to do that is just select it all, choose the Shape Builder tool. And the Shape Builder tool, as, you, as I move over that, you see it gets those shaded areas. If you click and drag across the shaded areas, like that one, that one, that one, you can see it turns it into, um, it joins those shapes together. So I think it would be these three. Uh, this is where it gets a little confusing. It's going to be um, those three and those three. Okay, that looks so pretty good. Uh, now we have to just join those like so. Those go that way. Those three. That's better. And then those three. And then we also have to join those and those three and those three and those three and when we click away from that you should now see we have a lovely Celtic knot made in Illustrator.